Welcome to That Board Game Show. My name is Hein van Yerden, and I'd like to tell you about Sushi Go. Sushi Go is a very fun, easy little game. It's a quick game to learn, and you can teach it to new board gamers. Let me show you Sushi Go. Sushi Go is, in its foundation, a card game. It's called a card drafting game because with this particular style of gaming, you would have X amount of cards in your hand at the start of each round. And in this game, you're going to pick a specific card out of your hand and put it down in front of you, while the remainder of your cards are then closed up and handed over to the player on your left. In the meantime, you will receive a new set of cards from the player on your right. So you'll have his cards to go and look through, pick from, and pick and put down on your side again. That is why it's called a card drafting game, because although you might have started with eight cards in the beginning, you don't necessarily have the same cards until they come all the way around the table back to you again. But in the process, some cards have dropped off, and in some cases, some cards could even have been handed back in. So it's a very strategic little game where you have to think about who has got what and what have you seen that's come past you and how can you build up the necessary points that you need in order to win this game. Now, apart from being a card drafting game, this is a very beautifully illustrated game. The foundation of the game is sushi. So you have got various types of cards that is inside your uh, collection, all representing different kinds of sushi. Uh, in my examples that I've got here, I have got some uh, salmon nigiri, I've got some tempura prawns, I've got some sashimi, some maki rolls, and there's an egg nigiri roll. Through the game, you can get multiples of these, and as you lay them on top of each other, you score additional points, which makes it quite intriguing because you have to keep seeing what's going to come around the table and strategize and see if you can get it into your hand in time. There's a probably, there is, sorry, three rounds that you go through in total, and after each round, you add up your scores, and then ultimately, the winner of the uh, entire game is the person with the highest scores at the end of round three. The game is geared for a two to five player. It takes about 15 minutes to go through, which shows you it's a very quick and easy game to play. And it's from ages eight and up. So adults, no problem to play with your children. It allows you to get visual discrimination of the various cards that you've got. You get some nice strategic thinking as you go through. And it's an engaging game for children because there's beautiful characters that's illustrated on the cards. Sushi Go, a fun game for every family to play. Thank you for watching That Board Game Show. See you soon.